Hi guys, lesson one of cloth diapering. Today we're gonna to talk about three types Three types of cloth diapers. There's many different types of cloth diapers, but I just wanted to present three basic options um, and tell you which ones we decided to use with Mamo and why. Um, so the basics of cloth diapering is, is actually a really simple system. The first type of diaper we're going to talk about are um, pockets and some kind of absorbent in, inside or insert. So um, this outer fabric is called PUL or polyurethane laminate. Um, and so through a thermally heated process, um, a plastic covering is thermally binded to this outside part here. So this part kind of feels like um, board shorts, if you have any like swim shorts. And the inside feels like um, plastic. So this is the waterproof side that will keep in all of the of baby's messes. So the way a cover system works is that you have this cover here, um, and then you put some kind of absorbent in, insert into the cover. So you would put it in just like this. This is um, cotton and hemp. Um, and you would fold it over like this. And this is what would go on baby. The pros for um, this cover system are that it's the most um, economically friendly option. So the inserts are cheaper and then the covers you can reuse if baby doesn't get them dirty. So if he or she pees in them um, and it's not, it's not wet, then you can wipe this out and then just reuse the cover again. So you might only need three or four covers a day. Um, it's really easy to clean because the outer and the inner comes apart during the wash um, and so they get really clean. Um, it also is really fast to dry so you can hang the insert or whatever your absorbent inner is, hang the cover, um, or just throw these in the dryer and these will dry very, very quickly. The cons are that it is, for someone who's not familiar with cloth diapering, it can be confusing because you don't know which, you know, which fabric to put on top, which closest to baby. Um, it is also probably the hardest to put on baby, in my opinion, in getting a really good fit on baby. Um, so those are the cons. The next type of cloth diaper that we'll talk about um, are pocket diapers. So pocket diapers, similar to the covers, they have this outer um, shell that inside is waterproof. It has a plastic here. Um, but instead of laying the absorbent inner on top, there's a pocket on the diaper. So um, there's openings here. Thirsty's has, um, which is a brand, Thirsty's has an opening here on the front and opening on the back. So what's great about that is you don't have to take out the insert before you put it in the washer before laundry. So the pocket works just like the name suggests. Um, you have this opening here and what you would do is you take your absorbent inner and you just put it inside the diaper here and then you would flatten it out and then you would make, flatten it out and the inserts in here. So when everything is prepped, all someone needs to do is open it up like a disposable diaper and put it on baby. So that's one of the pros to um, a cloth, I'm sorry, a pocket diaper, is that it looks just like a disposable diaper. Um, it's really user friendly and that someone could just pick up this diaper and, and put it on um, baby. The inserts, um, you'll want to either take them out or with thirsties, they'll agitate out during the wash. Um, and the pro for this too is it gets really clean in the wash. Um, and then also just like the covers, you can you know, hang dry these and put these in the dryer. So, or Ha hang dry both so that they have a really um, fast drying time. If you're also cleaning uh, poop off the pocket because there's only one surface here, um, it's really easy to clean as well. Um, the main drawback for pockets is that you do have an extra step in stuffing the insert into the pocket before using it on baby. Um, we, this is, Olu and I are um, like nightly routine no matter whenever we have laundry. We, um, stuff our diapers together and then we talk about our day, how it went, our dreams, our goals. And then we just prep the diapers for Mamo. So it takes about five to 10 minutes and it's really not a difficult process in um, stuffing pockets, but again, it is an extra step. This price point is a little bit higher than your cover and absorbent insert. Um, so it is a little bit more expensive for this type of system. 
or the last type of diaper I wanted to talk about today is what's called an all-in-one diaper. So this all-in-one uh, diaper is, just as the name suggests, everything that you need to diaper a baby is all in one. So here, the absorbent inner, um, these, these, these things here, um, are, they're sewed into the diaper. So anytime you're washing or drying the diaper, it will just go in the washer like this and we take it out, it will be of the dryer, it's ready to go back on baby. Um, so this is likely the easiest system for prepping because you don't need to do any prepping. It's just ready to go once it's clean. Um, the cons for the all-in-one type of diaper is that it is um, the most expensive type of diaper. Another con is that because everything's connected together, so if you're hand drying, this does take longer to dry or line drying. Um, and then if you throw it in the, the dryer, um, it does take longer to dry than um, the pockets or the uh, covers. As far as what our collection of diapers consists of, because we, um, our caretakers are our parents um, during the week when we work, we wanted an easy enough system for them to use so that um, we could use cloth all the time. So we have basically half and half of pockets and half half pockets and then half all-in-one diapers. Um, we started out originally with all pocket diapers um, and then I switched over half of our stash to all-in-one diapers. So um, yeah, these are the different types of diapers, three different types of diapers. Um, I hope that was helpful in for you. And if you want to learn more, stick around for lesson two.